all righty roo and cuckoo chew to you and all my nobody is not watching. I'm gonna close the credits and it's gonna still be short as fuck, but whatever. Um, ah, uh, fuck. Story, lame. Uh, writing, lame. Concept and character art, pretty decent. Environmental art, dope. Environmental animation. Radical Studio, cool, uh, fuck, god damn it, I cannot, sp I don't, I am not, uh, I do not speak too good the Russian, I just enjoy the vodka, um, all this is just, yeah, honestly, um, this game, it just wasn't good, it wasn't good, I am, I, I say this, I, I, I do say uh, spasiba to everybody who is part of it because you made the thing. I respect you for doing it. I appreciate your efforts. I feel like, uh, and I'm saying, I'm hoping this is like said, like I'm talking to Russian because uh, the, the way that I see here, but I don't think it is. I think it's, um, it's, it's uh, something it's it's not I don't think it's fresh um, I don't judge about you know locale or whatever like I'm just saying like I don't think it was translation that fucked up this game I think it's that they didn't keep to the brand and the they just was on rails it was it was lazy uh, it uh, when it comes to dialogue and stuff like that it just wasn't that good it just wasn't um, I'm pretty sure I did not get the best ending because I basically had to sort of obey this new guy who was the reason why I became a vampire in the first place and it's like why you that's not explained it doesn't make sense people leave when it doesn't make sense me is not there like there's this big you know it's a big thing at the end and what happens there's a bit of a struggle and this it's pathetic that uh, the guy who is my sire's, my adopted sire's actual child, like, directly. I've seen this guy pop people's fucking humans' heads like balloons in a row so fast he did, like, six. Like, bam, 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 bam. Like, he's tr trying to go for a record or some shit. Like he's on a game show. And then he just fights this other guy and throws him around in and out of doors without any real damage when he could have actually done something. Mia, his second in command, is nowhere to be found. Mysteriously not mentioned. And just... My sire or adopted sire who is kind of a manipulative vampire who's been doing stuff and did all this presence and stuff you know she could still be caught off guard that could totally happen but I tried to like stop and he's like nah nah fam just watch it's gonna happen anyway and a character who n never showed up prior that I'm aware of Maybe it's like, oh, well, if I'd done better at, 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 at watching who I was being tailed by. Because she did kind of sort of look a bit like that. Um, maybe I could have saved my sire, adopted sire. It's all just kind of bullshit. It's all just kind of bullshit. The writing is not good. It's very on rails. The art is good. Everything visual is the best part about it. Everything storyline and textual and it's lazy. It's lazy and not good. 
I shouldn't think that doesn't make sense that I just read that yeah I shouldn't it should at least be a little bit different take the fucking effort to change things a little bit so that what I did makes a difference instead of making it be like that doesn't make any sense and I don't think it's a translation error I think it's a lazy error the guy that I knew from the beginning is the bad guy and you gave me that but I can't do anything against him and it's like literally the fact that having hope on my team I work so hard for that she didn't even show up in the last bit what was the fucking point what was the point even having you know Agathon and Tamika all they did was basically get me out of being staked the two of them did that did I not finish the thing for hope did I not do it well enough I thought we were friends I'm just saying like am I supposed to like Play, is there like an ideal circumstance where it's like, oh well, if you played this character and you played and you got these on your team, then that's what would work. The other ones don't count. Because I thought I did good getting three people on my team, but Hope literally was just 86. What the fuck? She was just absent. And she was my favorite one. So, maybe I missed something and maybe, uh, you know, I don't get it. But, um, I just don't have a lot good to say about it. I, all I have to say is that I didn't really like, you know, Sophie. She was kind of a bitch, but it made sense. She wasn't such a terrible bitch. She just, you know, sent me to do her dirty work and her errands and stuff. Kaiser would not have helped me. It doesn't make any sense. Unless it was in his benefit. Still kind of didn't. It, why make this world? Why, why make this whole social thing? Then throw in a new character that does the thing. Why have the old character I can't do anything against or ever stop? Like, it makes it seem like there's more that could happen. But I did look it up enough to know that there's only like three endings. And the th endings aren't good. They're all... The... the completion ending is I think what I got I think I got that I, I, like I didn't look at my uh, trophy error yet but this is not a good game I do not recommend it and it makes me sad because I want Vampire the Masquerade to be something that I am a supporter of and want people to play and do I don't play a lot of games like this, text-based games and reading games and like, you know, choose your own adventure sort of style. I'm pretty sure this is bad among them. You have no free will with your use of your powers. You have no understanding of how much or how little you have of your ability. And it doesn't really matter, basically. Even when you can use it, if it it doesn't matter how little or how much you have it doesn't seem to it's gonna happen the way it's happening and fuck you and I don't really like that I don't like it when a game says fuck me you're on rails shut up eat it the story isn't worth it it's poorly written you're on rails I don't think it's going to make a huge difference if I changed, you know, clans and stuff. And this is my review. I can't, it, it, the, the, the credits aren't even long enough for me to even say this. So few people actually worked on this. 
And now I know I don't think they cho charge full price for it. I think it was like 30 bucks to begin with. I think I got it for like 15 or 7 or something. But still. You make me basically hate everybody. N you know. You make certain people seem important and they're not. Then you make unimportant people the, the thing. It's just... It's just poorly done. Like, if that were a movie, you'd be like, What the fuck? That doesn't make any sense. You get bad critical reviews because... Oh, the, the villain all along was who you knew it was all along because they showed you the, sh the, the shadow of them and you can point them out. But you can't do shit about it. It doesn't... And it's like... And it's like... Okay. I, I... You know, I did look up... Oh, hey. You know, like... Options, endings, and stuff. Prior. It's like... There's like three. I don't even know that I got the best one or the finish it ending. I think I did because I'm not dead. I wasn't dead, but... I tried not to spoil it for me, but like, if you only have three ending to three endings to a game like this, that's just kind of piss poor. Like, you didn't really put out a lot of effort, did you? That's not an insult to the people who actually made this. It's more an insult to the people who had control over how this was made. So basically, um. My rating is two middle fingers up for those who produced this, I guess, the, the people who chose it to be this way. And maybe again, production issues, money, blah, 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 funding, whatever, could have been an issue and they kind of had to wrap it up. It's sad to me that the most interesting and best parts are the background sometimes and that might have been me hallucinating that this is what vampire the masquerade as an ip in any way shape or form has as available to it at the time is pathetic and it's 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 spitting in the face of the world of darkness that I played uh, uh, whatever the werewolf game was you know I got that for cheap too because people told me they you know the the general review was I should I wouldn't play this for free and I paid for it and um, I paid for this and I paid for that. And I've been waiting for VTMB 2, which is probably never going to come out. And if it does, it's going to be 2024 or later. And it's probably going to be terrible. And I'll probably still play it when it's cheap or free or real, like I can get it on, you know, discount. Because so many of the hardcore people who were part of the first one that wanted to fix it left, fired, or something. So, you know what? My review is don't play this game. If you really like text based adventures and that sort of thing, play something else. Um, I don't play a lot of those. But, um, this one isn't good, and it doesn't offer a lot of options, and it's frustrating how your lack of freedom is so apparent, your lack of anything. Basically, you have the choice to get yourself killed real fast, or get yourself killed like a dumbass, and... I just cannot state how... 
annoyed that I am that I did all the work to get hope on my side and as my coterie and I got no benefit from it and the benefit of my coterie was literally two people being like hey we got you out of this thing okay we're gonna go away now bye you're welcome that like I honestly hope whoever is involved whoever would like made that choice they won't but I hope they hear it hope it's translated into their language and it's like you suck that sucks this is terrible you should feel bad about yourself you don't deserve to be a part of a project like that you don't deserve to be a part of something that means this much to people like I'm not even that huge like I love Vampire the Masquerade but I'm not like you know this isn't like my big f I just I do respect and love it and your disrespect is hurtful and annoying but ultimately it's more like you just don't even deserve to have the chance in the first place that's how bad this was um, again the best part was the art and the way it looked I don't think it's the translation that messed it up and made the dialogue bad I think it was just bad dialogue I think it was all lazy I think it was all not done properly or didn't have enough time I don't want to hate against anybody who did their part and tried their best because I don't know the circumstance what I do know is that there has to be somebody held accountable somebody has to know be that person who's like I made choices I did this I blah 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 you know and they failed they failed utterly they failed the IP and they didn't deserve to have any control over it and again it's like oh maybe that person didn't actually fail they tried they just didn't have the funding or the time or whatever and somebody above them producers or whatever you know shareholders or funders or whatever I don't know all I'm saying is this game kind of sucked like bad there were good parts but I feel like you'd really be pushing to try to expect anybody to play again because you couldn't do much in the first thing the only reason to be like let's see what happens for the story I guess which is poorly written and doesn't really matter. It's insane to me that the one, the first coterie vampire I got didn't even in the last moment. Maybe I forget. Maybe, maybe, maybe they did something and that sort of took them out of the running. But even then, the ones that did showed up just to fucking get me out. Then left. I, I just don't know what else to say other than I'm not the type of person to be mean or hurtful. I don't want to disrespect people who put their time and love and effort into a game. I just feel like there isn't a lot of love put into this game and the love that was wasn't allowed to bloom and it, it, it didn't that the whole game as a whole doesn't reflect that the art the backgrounds that's cool the writing not good the choices not good I could spend a weekend and 
make a better outcome. I could, I could literally try to duplicate this and with free things on the internet, text-based only, with a weekend. It would take a while. It would take a weekend. I'd, I'd need like a two, three days to do it. I'd have to focus on it and do it. I could make a better story. I could make a better thing. I could make a better outcome. I could, I could give branching parts. At least for, as I played it this time, for one individual character. And I'm a single individual on a three-day weekend. So I'm just disappointed. It's just... It's just... I'm trying to debate on whether or not the world would be better or not if this didn't exist. And that's the real problem. Is It's is that... We're... The, 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 that fans are so desperate for anything BTM that this still m probably made its money back I've heard nothing good about Swan Song um, I really was excited about I, and I couldn't play it but the, the, the blood hunt thing that seemed fun I don't, I don't know much about it and get to play it. I don't know. I just, it seemed like it barely flashed in the pan. Shadows of New York, I doubt I will because this was such a pain in the ass. I'm just saying like... Man, what is it with Vampire the Masquerade that just, it cannot get? I, like, it just, everything has to fuck it over. So, yeah, I guess that's my review. Um, almost all the vampires suck. The best person was probably, uh, fucking Torque. Um, Mia just disappeared for no reason at the end. Um, you get just, well, can't avoid that, can't do shit, can't whatever. Minimal endings, doesn't, you get three different things and you don't get to use your powers. Um, the best things are the art. The writing and dialogue are terrible. You're on rails, along with every other one, and um, it, I don't think it's a matter of translation issues. I think it's a matter of, it just isn't that good. And I apologize to those of you who actually cared and wanted to do the thing. Not that anyone's gonna hear this, it's just, it's fucking pathetic. It's fucking pathetic. It's fucking pathetic. So, yeah. I'd rather go to a library and, and dig up a choose your own adventure book. Some goosebumps when they were doing that. And it would be more enjoyable than this. Even though it would just be text. Because it would be better written. So yeah, that's my thing. It's um, if I were like stars out of ten, I'd be like two, maybe, and that's for the art and all that other stuff. I'd probably give it like a three and a half because I feel like the art and the backgrounds deserve recognition. But um. I really had to force myself to get through this. That makes me sad. Why can't we have good things from uh, the world of darkness? White Wolf, why does, you know, White Wolf or whatever it is just keep fucking letting this happen? 
so yeah that's it um, yeah ultimate uh, no rating pathetic sad disappointing please stop existing because you're bringing down I feel like every time one of these things happen it just makes it so that no one wants to, to support the, the IP and then it just it's like a self-fulfilling prophecy so all right that's it that's my my review it's not nice I already did other bad things and said other criticism. It's just... I feel like I've wasted way too much time on this. Man, that's really sad.